Hey guys, it's time to eat. That's something Sean and I can agree on. True. Even if we can't agree on much else. No. Hey, Palace Station is keeping it fresh at the Charcoal Room. And if you haven't made a reservation and you're looking to take your sweetie to a classic American steakhouse this Valentine's Day, right now is the perfect time to pick up the phone. Nothing says I love you like steak. So mm. And joining us now, it's not too late, by the way. You can get your reservation in. Joining us now from uh, the executive chef from the Charcoal Room, it's Eric Kiever. It's great having you, hey, buddy. Hey, thanks chef for Eric. having me, JJ. Eric. Sir. The freaking mustache game. I the know. The beard is great, but that Look mustache game is on point. Come on. Thank you very much. Good for you. I trust you with my stay. I trust you with my food. As you should trust I, any oh, chef oh my with goodness. your steak. Phenomenal. Let me tell you. Uh, uh, charcoal Room at Palace Station. For those who haven't been inside, what can they expect? Uh, they can expect a very great fine dining experience. Uh, we have everything from grass-fed meats, um, Great appetizers, um, but let's let's stay focused a little bit on uh, Valentine's Day yeah, here. Yeah, of course. Let's um, do that. We do have a really great venue in there with a lot of great, obviously, beverage options as well. Um, so yeah. Uh, Everything. Well, here's yeah. the thing. When we come out for Valentine's Day, we want to have a special experience, kind of a heightened experience. What well, your Valentine's menu kicks off, I think, at 4 o'clock in the afternoon yes. on Friday. There we go. Ooh, People yeah. can come down, and oh, wow. what we have in front of us should be addressed individually, Chef Eric. By the way, we have the gentleman who uh, created the menu. We're going to toss to him in just a moment uh, and give him special recognition. Yes. Let's go through each dish. Can we start with the prawns, please? The prawns. Yes. The prawns. Okay. Well, let's start with the scallops first. Scallops. Yeah. Oh, scallops. 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 So I thought um, those were prawns. No, sorry, they're scallops. I get them mixed up. from Washington. Yeah. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> so uh, right there we have a gremolata. That's right. I'm not on the ocean. Seared sea scallop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, shaved asparagus, microgreens, um, and then like a red wine burr rouge. Um, what is that? So it's it's like a red wine butter sauce. Oh, yeah. You know what yes. a Beurre Blanc is? Yes. So white wine, Beurre Rouge, gotcha. red wine. Gotcha. Okay. Mm. Um, so everything really, really complements well. So you can get that at Chuckle Room. Mm -hmm. um, also, we have kind of a starter course right over here. So it's the uh, jicama and beet salad, uh, goat cheese croquant, um, <laughs> beet puree, goat cheese, a um, little bit of arugula, um, and then raised baby beets. It's so fresh. It's awesome. Isn't that beautiful? It's super fresh. Beautiful. I didn't know what yeah. was in the middle of there. It's great. I was like, what is that? It's goat cheese. Hello. What are, what are we seeing up on the, on the, on the highest mm. elevation? So on the highest yeah. elevation, yes. it does yes. deserve to be on a pedestal it's because totally it is done. a foie gras torchon. Wow. Yes. So um, foie mm. gras is obviously goose liver. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so what we did is we made a torchon, so we rolled it really nice and tight. We uh, actually glazed it with a berry glaze. Um, wow. Toast points, nuts, and then a nice uh, compote. It's like Fagwa Wellington almost. It, I mean, yeah. it, it, it's better than. Yeah, it's pretty um, awesome. Because you take that on your toast, it's just so rich, it's unctuous. It'll definitely spark the mood, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, all right. Yes. I do. Good for you, Eric. Nice. I, I'm not sure what either of you guys mean by that. That's well, right. obviously, you've Could never you had a foie gras tour yeah, show. Exactly. Could you explain it to me? Uh, this is like, uh, this is, uh, you know, it's a. I'm still caught up on the prawns. Some would say uh, foie gras aphrodisiac. Yes. Yeah. Um, then yeah. we also it's the liver have, of love, they say. It's the liver oh. of I like that. I'm gonna start using <laughs> You're it. You're welcome. The yes. liver of love. I'm stealing it. It's in my back pocket <laughs> there we now. Go. Nice. Um, and then All we right, also steak. have steak. So uh, this is a Chateau Briand for two. Oh. So a Chateau mm. Briand is from the beef tenderloin. Nice. Uh, the most tenderest cut Certainly. of meat. Yep. So, I mean, if if you're a guy like me. I know what I'm about, and I would just finish that myself. Yes, but exactly. if you really want to have a nice dinner for two, this would be a great option for you. It has the beef. It has a nice, rich demi glace, baby vegetables, fingerling potatoes. Definitely would get uh, would, would be a nice dinner. L love is sharing. Sharing is caring. Yeah, sharing is caring. Yes. I wouldn't share that much. I'll let you have a piece or two. Yeah. Hey, I'll take it around. right now, can we share a little moment? Because Chef Dayron... Oh. Is over uh, on our stand up set. I want to give him a little toast. He's uh, designed cheers. this menu. All right, here we go. Thank you. Uh, chef, thank you so it's much. Beautifully well done, sir. He doesn't have a microphone. He can't talk. It's okay. <laughs> Congratulations. He can talk. He can't talk. He just, you know, you wouldn't hear him. Yeah. Yeah. He's sad. yeah. He's silent. So but we'll thank you. That's great. So he's the one who put this whole thing yes, together. Yes, Dayron has done a fantastic job getting this put together. Um, he is really the heart and soul of that kitchen. So nice. uh, very much kudos to Dayron. Um, appreciate you a whole lot. Nice. Um, so, Chef Eric, when I came up before the show, you kind of pulled a joke on me. Oh. And you told me that this whole menu was served without cutlery, like it was kind of an interactive romantic thing. And I totally believed him. Really? And he's like, no, no, we would never do that. There's forks Eric. involved. You're, so, um, you're thank, you thank you for that. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. I'm really gullible. <laughs> um, so, just for that, 
Can you're, I try the gonna, dessert? Yes. You, okay. I will let you try the dessert. What do we have here? As long as you use your hands. <laughs> okay, yes. Fine. Do it. Oh, there we <laughs> go. There it is. Perfect. So, red velvet cake, toasted mm. meringue, fresh berries, some oh, coolie, wow. and then uh, cream cheese frosting. Jealous. Jealous. Can't oh, have it. Yeah, it's can. mine. It's yours. Oh! It should have. Oh, my God. Yes, Would you like you. to try some, too? You, uh, you can use a fork, though. No, thank you very much. Yeah. You're very sweet. Thank you. I was so decadent. Oh, my God. Beautiful. Oh, this is Real great. men eat with their hands. You can still make reservations. We can still make reservations, so you can call Stations Casino, go to Palace SLV. Ah, Palace Station. Uh, Dot S C L. -E. Yes. We'll get it for that was you. always confusing there to me. Go. Sorry, Perfect. Right you got it. Uh, or OpenTable.com. That, great having you. Sir. That is an amazing red velvet cake. Perfect. Thank oh, you very much. Great smokes. having you. Thank Chef, you. Chef, thank you so much. Making it a charcoal room inside Palace Station. Mm. You heard about the Rothbard Up this Friday for Valentine's mm. Day. Great, great uh, selection. The fog wow. I mean, my goodness, look at that. That's lovely. The liver of love. Their website number right there on your screen. Station Casino is proud sponsor of the Morning Blend.